heat that's left over from the heating cycle. Mike Stritsky is not your typical homeowner. I've been called everything from the village idiot, you know, to the mad scientist. And this is not your typical home. I don't have to worry about, you know, power failures here. You know, fuel deliveries. I don't have to worry if that fuel truck doesn't come up that driveway. That's because Stritsky lives in the nation's first solar hydrogen house. The sun comes up, my uh, solar pa panels snatch that energy, and any excess go into these tanks. Stritsky's monthly utility bill is zero. His 3,500 square foot New Jersey home is completely off the power grid, right down to his big screen TV and hot tub. Solar panels are growing in popularity, but Stritsky's system is the first that converts and stores the excess energy as hydrogen gas, which in turn is converted back into electricity. With no emissions whatsoever. Sounds promising, but at $500,000, the system is still too expensive and too bulky for your average home. Even so, energy experts are all abuzz. I think it's exciting because it's showing you a little glimpse of the future. A future that could be closer than you think. Stritsky is working on mass producing his home energy system, which would bring the cost down to around $60,000. You know, if you're going to spend your life doing something, this is a pretty good way to spend it. Solving the energy crisis one home at a time. Alexis Christophorus, CBS News, Hopewell, New Jersey.